Margaret Rakes, social media expert. Kelsey Kastrava, former editor-in-chief of our school newspaper. Ramir Griffin, YouTube enthusiast. What do these three have in common? They've all experienced changing media around them. So in traditional or what we call legacy media, you would make a buy. So you would buy a TV spot or you would buy a page in a magazine. And then everyone who bought that magazine would purchase it. You would see it. They, hopefully they would see your ad. Hopefully it would have an impact. When I was editor-in-chief, we had um, 32 paper publications. We were just moving to a web platform uh, using WordPress. Uh, but it was the first year that we were really doing that. We were really focusing more on the print. Uh, the web actually was sort of a secondary focus of ours. 20 years ago, it would be really hard to make a video or like really hard to like even get recognized for what you do. Now it's, it's easier to the fact where phones have different uh, softwares and things like that where you can edit. With online advertising and with content marketing, you can, especially with advertising, you can serve it up. So what that means is that I get to choose much more specifically who I want to see it and only the audiences I want to see it will get served that ad. That make the, makes the ads much more cost effective and that makes the ads much more targeted. They're reaching the people they need to reach and not the people that they don't need to reach. Today, it, it's sort of my understanding that it's priority the priority is the web-based uh, locator. Um, and I think just in general, the way in which we all consume our news is completely different. And it's really based off social media. Quality is always there, but I think in order to, since this today's generation, we're all so quick and we're all so quick to go to the next thing, uh, consistency is, is much more important now than it was beforehand, I believe. Content has been good. Good content continues to be good content. It's just delivered in different kinds of ways and you could have a lot of different kinds of specific messages. So it used to be before if you made an ad buy, you made an ad buy for a certain amount of time. It took a little bit of time to get the data back to see what was effective and what wasn't effective. With digital, you have the serving thing where you're serving just the audience you want, but the data comes back almost in real time. So if something isn't performing, you can pull it much more quickly so you're spending your money better. I think that a paper newspaper is a dying thing. However, I feel like there is still that experience, I don't know if charm is the right word, to being able to go to a store and feel clothing and try on clothing. And I still think there is that with wanting to hold a newspaper and flip through a newspaper and appreciate, you know, the layout, the design. I don't think that the that the really established traditional legacy media is going to die the way that dinosaurs did. In terms of economic stability and industry stability, we have too much invested in old old media to just let it die. It just is not likely to happen. It might be less influential over time, maybe eventually, but I think we have still quite a long ways to go before we get there. I would say with my lifestyle where it's at, I prefer to re read things online. I prefer to be able to view everything from my phone because it's attached to me at all times. I think it's nice to walk through campus and pick up the newspaper and thumb through it, but if I'm going to be able to read it weekly, I would read it on my phone. And to my, my own preference, I will, would rather take time and focus on the quality of the video, take time and actually write out what I want like take time and get people that I want and really think all about it as opposed to uh, consistency or like mass production of videos. While media has changed over the years, the digital world offers new and exciting opportunities that has helped shaping our society today.